Positively Jacks tonight. He's known for the work that he does on the football field with the Jaguars. But today, Tom Coughlin's being honored for what he's doing off the field. Mayor Lenny Curry proclaimed today Tom Coughlin J Fun Day. News for Jacks reporter Crystal Moyer shows us that for more than 20 years, the foundation has supported local kids battling cancer with financial, emotional, and practical support for their families. <laughs> That's 18-year-old Isabel Scott playing the harp. She was diagnosed in January with leukemia while auditioning for a college music program. This video was taken earlier this year at Wolfson Children's Hospital where she continued to practice the harp while undergoing chemo. Now she's in remission, performing at the Tom Coughlin J Fund Ceremony, a foundation that supported her and her family through her cancer fight. It kind of feels special to be able to offer what I have to the people who have offered what they have to me. For more than 20 years, the Tom Coughlin J Fund raised $10 million, supporting more than 5,000 families and kids like 13-year-old Cash Addy. Despite several surgeries for brain cancer, Cancer, Cash keeps a positive attitude. It's cancer. It, I mean, you know, it's not something a kid should have. I think it's funny. I can make it not likes, make it not so sad, make it funny, you know, to people. His mom admits it has been difficult. There's been times that, you know, you don't know how you're going to pay your mortgage. She says the support from the fund has allowed her family to focus on what's important. He's the most important thing is making sure he's well being able to be there for him. Tom Coughlin, Mayor Lenny Curry, and representatives from Wolfson Children's Hospital and Nemours attended the ceremony, inviting dozens of families impacted by childhood cancer. The foundation giving them hope for the future. As for Scott, she's been accepted to the music program at Converse College in South Carolina. Crystal Moyer, Channel 4 The Local Station.